So this is my chest, almost two weeks post-op. I have the dressings on at the moment, but I'll do a little section um, to show you what it looks like without the dressings on. Also, I put them on a little bit crooked, um, but I mean you can still pretty much see what it looks like. So this is my chest um, without the dressings on, about almost two weeks post-op. So as you may be able to see, the nipples haven't healed yet. It's a bit better. The nipples haven't healed yet, and there's still some swelling around here. I'm not sure if there's any around here. Um, but it looks alright. Um, there's still lines from where Andy drew. Um, before the surgery, because I haven't, I've been really careful about uh, touching around the scars and the nipples. So, for the rest of the video, I'll put the dressings on, and then I'll just talk about my chest like that. Um, as for pain, just when I'm standing like this or sitting down, it doesn't really hurt very much. Um, sometimes I get, like, aching or, like, almost squeezing pain on the side here where it feels like it's really tight. Um, and I think that might be because I have some, some swelling and then when the um, compression vest pushes against it, it probably causes some pain. Um, but it might just be the incisions themselves, because that's also where I got the, um, where I had the drains in. Um, and my nipples also hurt sometimes. It's more of like a stinging pain, but that doesn't usually last for very long. Um, but it's still quite annoying and it feels like my chest is still very sensitive uh, it's quite it's very numb right over here uh, like actually like when I was touching it because I had to, to kind of clean around the area it was really uncomfortable because it was extremely numb um, the numbness everywhere else it's only really numb really surrounding the incision and right um, on the edge of where the nipples are also, I've been getting some pain, like, up here, um, which I thought was a bit strange because, um, the surgery was performed down here, but I guess it's just because all the muscles are kind of connected and just surrounding in general, so it's not that surprising, but, yeah, it seems to hurt more up here than down here, but that may be because I'm completely avoiding moving this area of my chest if I can. Um, I might raise my arms a little bit, but that's basically as far as I'm willing to to move them you know, like backwards a bit to like scratch my back and like, maybe like that. I've also been getting some weird like pulsating feeling over this side of my chest. Um, it's not constant, but I noticed it yesterday when I was on the bus it felt like a kind of thumping like over here and I noticed like I, it was really frustrating me so I tried to um, get rid of it and I noticed that when I when I looked that way it stopped because I was looking out the window like this so I don't know if it's just like a muscle thing, but that was really frustrating, and I never got that before. I didn't get it on this side, so I don't know what that's about. I can sort of stand up straight now, um, and I can put my shoulders back, which I couldn't do a couple of days ago. Um, I'm still kind of... 
I'm still kind of slow about it though, just because um, when I move too quickly, like I notice when I stand up too quickly, it does kind of hurt and, and pull a little bit. So, um, if you want to see this is up close, um, again I do have the dressings on now, but you can still see the shape of it, which I'm quite happy with, except <laughs> I noticed that it now makes my stomach look a lot bigger because my chest is so flat, but I think part of that is um, I'm still quite bloated, um, but it's slowly uh, going back to normal in my stomach area and the digestion side of things, but I do, I was worried that when I, after I got the surgery that my chest would be like completely flat because it was hard for me to judge how much muscle tone I actually had um, because obviously you know there were like extra lumps there um, but Andy actually commented when I saw him right before the surgery um, he noticed that I'd been exercising which was cool so you know it's always good when other people notice and my muscles, as you can see, still kind of goes out, even though I haven't been able to exercise for uh, about, you know, since before I got the surgery, so that's good. Um, it really helps me to see my chest like that, um, just more aesthetically appealing to me. And I think I'll change the view now because I'll just talk about my actual surgery experience and what it was like in, in the past two weeks.